Let's try that again. We are live. Hey. Now we're live. Yeah. Uh, we're live and we're playing Oak tonight, everybody. Oak. Oak. Fresh. Oak. <laughs> yeah. So Oak, right, from uh, Game Brewer Games, designed by... I'm awful at that. I can't read from here. Designed by uh, Wim Guzins. Sure. Gusins? I'm sorry. Sorry. About your I put you on the spot. Yeah, I know. It put me on I the knew spot. it was hard. To... And I'm and I'm bending over that. the table trying to read the name in the beginning. It's a tough. With. It's a tough font, also. It yeah, is a tough font. Yeah. The font was not my friend. Yeah. Yeah. The it's oak like... part, however. Oh, the is oak very is very easy to read. Yeah. yeah. And spell. So I'm Ryan. I'm Anthony. I'm Chris. And we are playing Oak tonight. Um. So and you guys never played Oak. I've done it no. solo. So I'm gonna quickly run through the rules with you guys. Mm -hmm. It's pretty straightforward. So I'm gonna bring up the main board up on screen, and we could discuss it. All right, and you guys can look at this, right? Um, okay. So in Oak, what we're trying to do is we are a group of druids trying to gain victory points because that's what druids did. Um, okay. So what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be playing. Uh, our druids out on the board and we're we're either going to be putting them out on the board putting them on our pl individual player board playing cards from our hands to do the to do those actions out on the board or playing these cards from our hands to climb up the tree and uh when you climb up the tree you eventually get to a point where you have to branch off and decide which path you want to go and when you decide when you get to the key if you land on a key at the end of the round you are going to be scoring all those bonus victory points. Hmm. Um, and then the last thing you do before, and the round is indicated when uh, everyone has passed and there is no more meeples out here in this board area, okay? Um, and we're going to be collecting these ingredients to indicate that too during your pass turn. So if you pass, it's back to you. You can grab one of these ingredients. Um, well, we're going to be using these ingredients to brew potions, okay? Uh, we're going to be playing dress up as well too. So, um, <laughs> we could upgrade our meeples and add cool accessories to your meeples of like a little hat or like a cape. Okay. Um, and those actually are beneficial and do special powers that are pretty cool. Um, we also could recruit different like creatures and we could, uh, work on discovering different artifacts. So, how the game is going to go, it's over five rounds. Um, we're going to start with Anthony, who's a starter player. And on your turn, you're going to be doing uh, an action. So, the action, if you're going to be doing an action on your player board, uh, there's different circles indicating what kind of, what kind of uh, person you could do. So, if you have a, like a white circle, you could put whoever you want. Like, it doesn't have to be an elder. But and if it is a gold-bordered one, then you have to put an elder. And an elder is an accessorized meeple. Okay. okay. So most are going to have our six elders in your possession at once. Um, so that's that. That's the standard. You do that action. And, and to clarify, we actually all have, our board, boards all have some slight differences. So yes. the boards are not the same. Correct. Because that very often you have a player board and that is all the same. In this case, that is not true. Yep. So we all have different abilities like mine. Um, I could, I could do, a, I could, I could craft a potion or I could take three ingredients from the bag. Right. So I, could, I only have one spot to go on my player board. Yeah. Board. With an elder. Okay. And that one, you just get one of these for free. Okay. One of these art, uh, creatures. And then yours is you could actually upgrade one of your workers into an elder. Yep. Oh, you're going to get that cape in no time. He's <laughs> been talking about this cape for like 20 like minutes already. Um, so we also have uh, different resources we're going to have. So we got feathers, we have mistletoe, and we have like these uh, Ten Commandments or whatever you want to call I don't know what they are. They're called stones. stones. Just called stones. I guess stones, right? Um, so those are your resources. And you're going to be using these resources to also play these cards. Okay. I see Danielle. Yeah, she's saying the unique player boards and meeples are giving me a Dwellings of Eldervale vibe. Plus you get to dress them up too. Because yeah. I know in Dwellings Elder really just put some like a top on to return into a hat, but I'm enjoying this game a lot more. Now, um, spoilers, I really like this <laughs> so far. Um, so you're gonna be doing an action out on this board. You'll notice they correspond to those three kinds of uh, 
resources. And of those cards that you're going to be playing, you're going to have one card of each kind of resource as well, too. So if you want to do the one of these mistletoe actions, you mm -hmm. play the mistletoe card, and you pick what circle you want to go to. So you'll notice this is the one, level one circle, this is the level two circle, and this is the level three circle. So if you're going to do the level one action, you just go, you put your, you put your, uh, your worker, your druid worker out on there. You do the level one action by spending the resources, right? So I spend three mistletoe, and then I do the action to the right of it, which is look into the ingredient bag and take an ingredient of my choice. Hmm. Now, this is pretty standard worker placement where place <coughs> spots can be blocked off, but other players can go in them at a higher cost. So it's not yeah. totally blocked off. Okay. So let's say if I want to go back into this spot and do this action, what I have to do is I take one of my ready workers, put them out there, and then spend another ready worker and put them out into this passive area. Okay. Um, that's important to note. And it's not, it's not just for uh, my myself too. Like I could, the same thing would happen if I went over here right. to another player that would be blocking it. Okay, because these areas are going to get taken up. Um, when you play a card for the action, the, act, the card goes away for the round. The other thing you do for the card, though, other than the top three actions, is this bottom part. And you could spend the particular resource to go up on this tree track. Got it. Okay? As soon as you go up on the tree track, you're going to get two points. Every spot you move up, you get two points. Okay? Um, and... Uh, you're going to go up the particular tree track you went up. So on that mistletoe one, if I played it for the tree track portion, I'd go up on the green track, which is the center one. Right. And you can only have at most one of your people, and you take you take from the people down below. It's not like you take a ready worker. You take Got it. Okay. one of the passive ones. They go up. Um, and you can only have one person per path. So there's three paths. You can only take one person per path. So once you send them down a path, that's where they're going. Right. For just you or anybody, like are they are they blocked spaces. No, they're not blocked. They're shared spaces. But there are there is moments of blockage, and I'll get to that in a minute. Um, so you're going to be advancing this track, and the reason why you would want to advance this track is every time you do, you get two points, and at some point you're coming to a crossroads where you get to decide do you want to go left or right, and depending on which way you go is pretty much what you're going to score additional victory points for. So this one. If you land here, when you score this, you're gonna, which is at the end of the round, if you're there, you're gonna get a victory point for every five victory points you already have on the board. Hmm. This one, for every upgraded meeple you have, you're gonna get two victory points. For every creature you have, you're gonna get two points. For every uh, completed potion, you're gonna get two points. For every shrine, which are those cards over there, uh, or uh, I forget what the other building's called, but it's the opposite side of the shrine, you're gonna get two points. And for every artifact you have, you're going to score three points, which are these circles over here. Um, so at what point does it branch off where those those dots are? Uh, yeah, so you could see, like, if I go here and then here, I now get to branch off if I want to go left or right. So I can go either this way or this way. Got it. um, it's important to note that multiple people can be there. So I can be there. Anthony, you could be there too. The thing is, if Chris was here, right... And the round is over. You and I both score this, and this is now locked. And Chris cannot go that way. And if he, even if he was over here, even closer, he still can't go that way. So if you get there and the round ends and you have made it all the way up, yeah, then yeah, got it. So that's it's important to kind of play with that pacing. Yeah. Um, you also may notice there's these little things over here, these little banners. Like, and what's going to happen is when you pass one. You're going to advance this solstice meter, okay? And eventually it's going to come to a point where you reach a, sol uh, you reach a solstice. And, they get, and that's where the two hands are. That's a solstice thing, apparently. Uh, wherever your meeple is on the tree, so let's say if this was the situation where it was like this, I'll put one more of Chris's right over there. Um, if your, I'll put mine over here. I'll put yours over there. And I'll put yours over there. If your victory point marker, oh, it's kind of hard to see on the board. Uh, I'll slide this down for one minute. If your victory point marker is before the solstice meter, you can gain those resources you're standing on. So, Chris, you're going to gain one stone, 
and this guy is going to gain one mistletoe. Anthony, you're going to gain one feather. Hmm. Because I've passed it, I'm not going to gain anything. So it's a catch-up mechanic of sorts? I guess so. Yeah, hmm. I, I guess Sort so. of a catch-up mechanic? Sort of. It's a friendly help. Yeah. So. So, yeah. Uh, and this also advances at the end of the round, too. So you could choose to trigger it, but also at the end of the round, it's just going to automatically move forward. Got it. And then most it's ever going to get to is that point. Uh, so that's how that works. Um, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's a spam bot, looks like. Yeah, thank you, spam <laughs> bot. We appreciate, you know, your, your offer. Um, so anyways, let me slide this back down. Boop, 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 and boop. And I'll take my three guys take back. Your pieces back. Yeah. So let's talk about some of the other actions you can do, because most of them are going to be on your cards. I'll keep going on the mistletoe card first. So the first one is you could take an ingredient from the bag. The second one is you could build a shrine. Give me that one, that card. Yeah. So you can either build a shrine or actually, well, it's really the opposite. You don't build the shrine. You build the other one, which I think is called like a dwelling or whatever. And you're going to slide this in the top spot of your board. Okay. And you're going to score the points that are under it. So if you slide it this way, you're going to score four points. Mm -hmm. If you slide it this way, you're going to score two points. The reason why this is important is because when you're t when it's time to return your workers back, you need to make sure you have housing for all your workers. Oh, yes. Okay? So notice we all have three spots. You can slide them up so you can see what kind of workers can go in them. So mm -hmm. yours, uh, you have two that are only regulars. This can be a regular or an elder. That's why this is important, because if you do the 2.1, you can do a regular or an elder. Or if you do a 4.1, you can only do a regular. And my board is all regular or elders. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. That's so, also why I only have one spot, though. I mean, yeah, that's true. Um, so, and the same thing for mine, too. Uh, so that's how, like, the housing works for bringing your people back and why you may want that. Now, when it comes to this portion of the mistletoe card which is you spend six to upgrade a worker druid to an elder druid. Mm -hmm. So if you flip over your reference card, you're going to see all the options that you can flip them over to. Okay. And they all have different special powers and we can get to that later. Um, but just know that all of them have special powers. The only one you can't build is the ancient elder, which has a really cool uh, moose hat. You can only build that by brewing a potion right over there. Okay. And then most of you have is one. Um, I'm going to skip ahead now to the stone card. The stone card, you could spend three stone to take two workers, two passive workers, and put them into your board. Into but your you spot. have to have the spot but for them. But you have to have right? the spot for them. That's correct. This one is you could spend three stone to brew a potion. In order to brew a potion, you need the matching ingredients to do so. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we start off with no ingredients, but that's why gathering ingredients when you pass is good because then you can start getting these. Um, and they require all different things, and they do all sorts of different powers, okay? These get replaced or no? They do get replaced okay. at the end of every round. Um, this last one for the stone, <coughs> you can spend four to go to the spot three. And when you do that, if you go over there, Chris, can me those cards? Yes. I set those aside. So we could actually get, you could actually get more cards. And these three, there's three cards, uh, upgrade cards, mm -hmm. and they're all better versions of what you have. Okay. Okay. So you can choose to get one and add it to your hand. And you can play it immediately too. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. Um, last one, this feather one. So for one feather, you could advance this little triangle to the right. And that's important because the most, uh, P cards you can put under here can't pass this triangle. Yeah. Same with this one. So you can move either triangle. You can move either triangle. Okay. Now, the other thing is, too, you might notice there's resources next to these. Mm -hmm. That indicates that at any time, you could spend those resources and just do it. No action required. Just spend three feathers and you you do it for that one. And for okay, mine, so this, three this top one is for the dwellings, and what's this bottom this one? This bottom one is for these. The, okay. The, uh, the, creatures. the creatures. Got it. So with these creatures, when you recruit one, you're going to score three points, and then you get the ability for that particular creature. Okay. It's going to get tucked under this way, okay? Uh, and that's the second part of this feather, yeah. so it ties in perfectly. Um, 
If you're not happy with any of these three creature options, you could spend one Mistletoe to discard all these cards and draw three new cards. Okay. Okay. The next one is the Artifacts. Now, the Artifacts is this third feather spot right here. And you could choose to spend six feathers to gain an Artifact. And you're going to put it right on this little slot right here. You mm -hmm. see that nice little fancy slot. And notice it's pointing. So what you're going to do is you're going to score four points immediately for, for doing that. And anytime you put a worker there, it's going to trigger that ability. And you're going to rotate this. And when you rotate that, that's how many points you lose. Ew. Yeah, so anything, any points in red is how many you lose. Eek. But it is a cool ability. This one lets you play a card that you've already played that turn without spending the worker or the resources. Okay. Pretty right, so nice. It might be worth lo losing a point. Yeah. Correct. And the next time you do it, you lose two points. Next time you do it, you lose three points. And then eventually it's gone? Yeah, eventually it's gone. And yeah. you keep it, though, with you because it might be beneficial for scoring, like in right. that spot. Got it. Um, at most, you can have is two. Um, but there is a way to get a third if the specific card, I believe, comes out. But otherwise, you can't, like, change them out. For yeah. Correct. You can't okay. change them out. Um, but And the only way they rotate is by doing that. Though I believe this potion allows you to rotate those those uh, those artifacts as well yeah, too. It does have a rotation. Yep, that's what yeah. It looks like. Yeah, it looks like that one's for rotating. So that one is just yeah recharge. Oh, you recharge up to two of your artifacts by rotating them two spaces counterclockwise, allowing Ooh. them to be used more times. Okay. So it's the opposite. You get to turn them back so you could use so them again. So would you get those four points again if you turned it back to that spot? This does not cause you to regain or relose the VP now aligned with your player board. So good question. Wow. It's, it's already like answered. This was staged. It was staged. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this one you get you get nine of any resource. Okay. And then most you can have is nine. These tracks just go yeah. up to nine. Okay. And then lastly, you get the ancient meat. Now are these spots to go to? Or no? no, those are just okay. your resource just trackers. Got it. Yeah. Those are just your resource trackers. Um, um and i think is that pretty much the game at this point that's pretty much the game so once we're all done which means we've all passed and we ran out of ingredients we're gonna go through these different phases where we're gonna return our workers put them back into their spots uh claim any keys we're gonna draw back our cards we're gonna refill the ingredient pile we're gonna move the solstice marker we're gonna rotate the player turn marker and we're gonna rotate the turn order mm -hmm. and then we collect mm -hmm. income and we should point out, just for people, that this is like the retail version yeah. of it, and it looks beautiful. Yeah, it looks great. As a, as a retail, this is, and there's a better version of it, so that goes to tell you. Well, you know, well, it's I mean, better, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, not better, deluxe version. There's, yeah, which, there's, there's a Kickstarter one. But yeah, but I'm saying it looks pretty beautiful for a, yeah, for the retail product, so. All right. Cool. You feeling lucky? Punk. Punk. <laughs> you start. <laughs> Okay, so I'm playing one of these cards. Well, yeah, I'm picking a spot to go to and playing a card at Correct. the same time, pretty much, right? Yeah. Woo, boy. All right. Well, um, I think uh, I'm gonna do some mistletoe. Oh, nice. And holly. Okay. So I take one of these guys. Yep. And put it on one of these. Yeah. Yeah. And depending on which one you go to, what I want to do, so I can spend up to six mistletoe to do the little upgrade thing. Yeah. Okay. And, sorry, did we talk about how these help us? Oh, yeah. So, the specific things that they're going to do when you upgrade a particular character. The first one, right? Uh, that's one. This one lets you, uh, when you go to a spot, mm -hmm. uh, you spend two less resources. Okay. The second one is you're going to, is the bard. And this one just gives you an additional spot to the left of your player board. Ah. So, you have, instead of going right, you can go left now. Um... This one right here, the a gatherer, I think it is, is going to uh, brew potions with one less ingredient. Okay. Okay. Uh, would you mind taking that? The next one, the parrot, the parrot guy, uh, you get to go to a spot without spending the additional worker, so if it's occupied. Okay. The next one is the, uh, I, th I think the nomad or the, uh, yeah, I think like the nomad. Superhero. Or, yeah. Well, he, yeah. Superhero. <laughs> so the superhero goes to the fortress of solitude, which is separate <laughs> right over here. <laughs> so you have its own set up dwelling, uh -huh. which is great. <laughs> which means you can easily bring in more pieces. Yeah. So. 
And, and then uh, lastly, uh, there's Jor-El, who can do everything. <laughs> and Jor-El also gets this guy. The Ancient Ooh. gets this guy. So you have your own custom board. Because he has literally every power, including extending the board. And has his own dwelling wow. in place. So he becomes one with the tree. He does. Yes. He has his own tree. He's like, he he, his own look, tree. he's even like peeking out. Hey. Hello. <laughs> hey, how's it going? I don't know, man. If I learn anything from Star Wars, it's do not go into those trees with holes in them. Oh yeah! Oh, Spoilers. For sorry, sorry. Empire Strikes Back. We just came right. out. <laughs> uh, all right, all right. Oof. Okay. So I think I'm gonna go and gather some things from the bag. Okay. So I'm gonna go to this first spot. Okay. I'm gonna pay three. Three mistletoe. Mistletoe. And for that one, that particular action, you get to look in the bag. And what am I taking? Uh, you take any ingredient. One? Yeah, you get to look. Well, I don't know what I want. Uh, depending on what potions you may uh, want to brew. Uh, what's this unoccupied potion? Oh, spot? great, great one. So anyone could do this one. Uh, and what you're going to do... Actually, all these anyone can do, okay? Hmm. Um, this one, you're going to score three, five, or seven victory points if you use three different, four different, or five different potions. Mm -hmm. And this one X over here is indicating at the end of the game, you have one potion you could brew of your ingredients so at the end of the game everyone gets a bonus of brewing this one interesting and over there in a the little cupcake tin are little uh potion victory like you know little potion check marks to indicate you've brewed a potion okay Huzzah. all right so i'm gonna take an acorn yeah do I take an acorn like that's it do. you can put it wherever okay okay that's it that's my turn that's it it's your turn you done did it okay I am going to do the mistletoe as well. I'm going to go right down here, and I am upgrading a worker. Uh, so I'm spending six to go to zero, and I am going to get the gatherer worker. So I get to brew with one less potion. And I'm going to put it on this particular worker right here because this is uh, their dwelling. Okay. I have a nice little, 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 little satchel. There. Now, I don't need to play a card to move Messenger to my bag. spot, correct? Correct. So I'm going to go here and upgrade a worker. Nice. I think I'd do that on the first turn sounds it's like pretty powerful. the right way to go. Now, the question is what I want to get. The brewing the potion sounds nice. I also, which is the one now that I can go into any spot that someone's been? Oh, that's the, the parrot. Fourth one. That's the parrot. So that's what I'm going to do. Yeah. Because I really like that idea. You just want to be a pirate. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. So you can see everybody here. He gets to go because it's hard to tell. Pirate dream. That's great. And then he goes there. Yeah. He's stuck there for this turn. Pretty much. Yeah. That's okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Would you mind laying him down for camera purposes? Yes, camera purposes. Sorry. That's, that's, all right. that's all right. I need to apologize. I'll put him right here for everybody to see. Cool, 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 cool. So it sounds like it's back to me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right back to you. I'll take this away from you. Yeah, this one's interesting because I had not heard much about this one until more recently now. Yeah. And I like my worker placement games. So I was glad when you brought this up. Well, I heard about it on So Very Wrong About Games. Their review was pretty stellar. All right, so I'm going to go to this double feather spot. Okay. Which Spend six cost feather. me six feathers. Mm -hmm. And I get one of these things? Uh, that's correct. All right. And if you're not happy with any of them, you can spend a mistletoe to change them. This is what? So this is any time you build either a shrine, which shrines, by the way, you can build over here. And only one of your, your elder workers can go there to spend three of each to build that shrine. And it gives you six points immediately. Um... So what this is doing is whenever you build one of those or whenever you build uh, an additional dwelling like cave, mm -hmm. you're going to gain a random ingredient from the back. Okay. This one, I believe it's from the back. I'll double check. This one right here, any worker you place down on a spot, you can count it as if it were the second spot in that in that area. Oh, I want that. Okay. Was that a weasel? That's a weasel. Yeah. Figures. You got the weasel. Dope part you. Do I have Bless three you. points for this immediately? Three points immediately. And where does this You're thing get tucked somewhere? Tucked underneath there. Yep. Got it. All right. Then we have 
Abhartak. Abhartak. A fartak. My turn. Uh, I'm gonna do this one. So I'm doing the 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 root the stones. I'm gonna go over to this spot, and I'm gonna spend three stone to take two of these guys and put them into my little dwellings for them. All right. <clears throat> I think what I'm going to do... I'm down. <laughs> uh, I took that spot. So I could get one of... I don't know what I should do. Let's have some fun and get some... Now, when do we get these cards back at the end of every round? Yeah, at the end of every round. I think what I'm going to do, because you took the action to get more people, I can't do that without doubling down at this point. Correct. But what I could do was I could play this with the feather and get one of, is this the artifacts? Uh, which one? This one. Yes, it's the artifacts. I'll do this. I will play this. This says I go to the third spot in the feather section. Right here. So we'll go here. You spend six feather. Six feathers. Goodbye, feathers. Hmm. And I'm going to get me an artifact. And what are my artifacts here? So this one lets you play a card you've already played that turn without spending yeah, the worker or the one. resources. This one gives you six feathers. Straight up six feathers. Straight up six feathers. This one lets you build one of these like dwelling things. Which is the dwelling things? Uh, it gives you additional spaces for your workers. Hey, you know what? I think the six feathers sounds pretty Okay. Useful. You spend six feathers, you get six feathers. And I get four points. You get four points immediately. So Do I immediately get six feathers as well? No. So you okay. have to go to that spot to activate. To do it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Understood. We're not doing this bottom stuff on these cards yet? You can. So and it's either or. So, yeah. You okay, either okay. do it for the action or you do it to uh, to climb up the got tree. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Yeah. All right. So all I've got is these rocks. That's <laughs> a bunch of I got a rock. I got but a I want to I wanna climb the tree. Yeah. So I'm going to use three rocks. And I take this guy here. Mm -hmm. And he goes on the first rock spot. Like this. Like here. Or uh, here. Right there. Yep. So you're going to gain two points immediately. Okay. So you're now at five. And that's it. Sweet. Sure. Cool. You're getting it. See? It's pretty straightforward. You play yeah, a card. You we'll do see. a thing. You move on. Yeah. Uh, all right. So... Let's see. So a new one opened where I can upgrade a worker. That's really tempting. So tempting. And I'm going to do it. So I'm going to spend six feathers. I'm going to get that one. So now I'm, I'm going to get four points. And then my own spot to upgrade workers. Got it. Your turn. Yeah, so I've got two options here. Oh, and a new one comes out. Take card. Okay. Uh... I got an option, and I could send some up this tree, which seems like a decent idea right now, to be quite honest. Mm. Um, but I could go a different direction. It's a big tree. It it's is a big, big tree. tree. So I'm going to spend this one, and I'm going to... So does he go passively here, or does he not move? Who's going? If I'm doing the bottom action. So you're doing the bottom action, they come from the this thing. I think like, this is going to cost me three of these. Oh, so I should have... So that's oh yeah. yeah, yeah, my yeah. bad. Yeah, right. they they come from the bottom. Yeah, sorry. So, so he's gonna go here. Yeah. So you're gonna get in two points. Yep. You're in the lead now. Hooray. Two okay. Anthony's up. Right, so what do I do? I have any more cards. Uh, well, you still have. Oh yeah, you can't go I to can't that go spot there. That's I need to be uh upgraded. Yeah. So I guess that was poor planning on my part. That's okay. So what do I do now? Uh, you could choose pass. to pass. You can pass. Right. I kind of have to pass. Yeah. Okay. So what you're going to do when you pass is you're going to take one of these workers, put it here, and mm -hmm. gain an ingredient. No. One of these five. Oh. Well, then. I'm going to take this here mushroom. Smart call. Boop. And then the round is going to end when either, when all players have passed, sorry, the day phase ends immediately when all players have passed and... All ingredients are gone from the forest, or there are no druids on the roots of the oaks. Okay. Okay. Ooh. So everyone's passed, and either all this is gone, or all these are gone. Okay. Okay? And you're going to just keep 
you know, I'd just be sleeping up, taking up all these so like every potions. time it comes back to me. If, yeah, if everyone didn't pass, you yet, take a actually, potion. Yeah. All right. Uh, pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go over here and upgrade a worker. Boop, boop, boop. Have you not used any of your? Because when you no, not yet. Oh wow. Yeah. You uh, actually played a person on the board then. Well, I did, and then I got my people back. Remember the two. Oh, the two. yeah, because you got two back. Yeah, that's right. So I'm gonna get Superman. And I'm going to lose a victory point. Mm. Now, it might sound bad, but the thing about losing victory points is you may want to, depending on where you are with the Solstice Drive. Mm. Right. Because um, I was thinking about the fact that I could go get some feathers right now, and next round I'll be at nine feathers. Yeah. Which is pretty powerful. Yeah. In, in terms of... Well, keep in mind, you're going to start with three... You're going to gain an income of three of every... I understand that's why I'll be at nine. Cause I'm oh, at because of six. Feathers. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. So... But I also have this, which I have the stone section. The only available spot to me is the third, which would get me another card. Oh, yeah. That's nice. So you get to get one of those cards. Right. So hypothetically, that's a pretty good move, and that would allow me to upgrade one of my cards, right? Mm -hmm. Or is it a new card altogether? No, it's a new card altogether. All right. And that's going to cost me four to do that, so I think I'm going to do that. Um, four stones. Okay. Okay is what it's going to cost me oh. so i'm down to two and then i take any one of my cards or do is it random uh you choose Ooh. okay and it, after that i that my turn will be done i guess um it's just this so no, i'm just going to take another one of these and put it yeah mm -hmm. Ooh, zero is it zero basically the longer we take the more ingredients you get what we call a nice so trade confirm, Does that spend zero and you take a resource? So what it is, is you get to exchange resources. Oh. So you could spend three feathers to gain three mistletoe. Ooh, interesting. Okay. And this is spend zero feathers to place... To get a worker. To get a worker. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's kind of nice. And that's move up the track? Uh, That's move up any track, yeah. <clears throat> You took your ingredient? I did. Perfect. I took uh, ginger, I think it is, maybe? Okay. Some kind of root. I'm going to take three from the bag. Thank you. Two, two, shot. Your turn, Chris. Yeah, I should have chosen smarter and gone up the path, quite frankly. I should have taken the other one like this and just used it to go up the path and spent three. So, you got greedy. I got greedy, so I will pass at this time oh. and get one of these ingredients so Anthony stops taking them all. Um, what is this? Bullets. Yeah, but there's nothing that's... You know what? I guess I'll take one of these. Okay. I was first in the store. Sorry. Yeah, that's all right. So my only option is I could brew, but I don't have what I need to brew. Um... Important for you now because you have ingredients and you have none. Right. Um, but as the game goes on, you could spend two of any. You could discard two of any, any of any ingredient to gain one res of any resource. Oh, okay. okay. So yeah. I get another one again, right now. Yeah. Yeah. Will. Yeah, okay. Okay. Hmm. I am swimming in ingredients. Yeah, I don't like that. I don't like yeah. the swimming. But I think I might have to do the same. Yeah. So I will pass. And so you'll take that. I'll take that. That's it. Do these go back to the forest? Uh, so hang on. So the first thing we're going to do cool. is we're going to take all of our workers on worker placement spots back. So not the ones in the forest. And you have to put them in the proper dwellings if, if you can. And like I like I have an extra like I I don't have enough dwellings for that guy so I just put this guy right over here. Mm -hmm. This guy goes back here. These guys are gonna go back there. Do you have a dwelling for that guy? Oh wait, I think this guy was. I think I took one back because I didn't oh, okay. have extra people. Got it. Um, okay, so the next thing is if anyone has a key, we we would flip that player and lock that key. The next is you take your cards back. 
So that's number. That's letter C. Letter D is you get to add in the ingredients if you don't mind. So the number of greens you add is three plus number plus two, because number of players plus two, and then so really all five of these spots. That indicates it's a four-player game. That's what. Really okay. <laughs> um, and then we move the solstice marker. Okay. <laughs> uh, pass this over. Is now round two. You're all behind it, though, right? I'm behind. We're all, we're all behind it except you. Yeah. But there's no solstice right now. We so don't gather. Matter. Yeah. So. Okay. I, I think it's meant for the seasons, right? This is probably winter, right. I'm guessing. Mm. Right. Guessing. I don't know. We're just going to say yes. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to all gain income. So everyone's going to gain three of every resource. And if you had any more hands, you would gain those too. But I don't think anyone else has any hands. So we're good there. Okay. Um, okay. So now we get to go on to the next round. Uh, so let's see what I want to do. I could... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to... That happen. yellow person stays there. Oh, good question. Right. The yellow person, so this is like the, the three-player adjustment, is going to go to the next printed uh, druid. So that spot is now taken. And next round, this spot will be taken. Oh, it's wherever the... Okay, got it. Yeah, got so it, got boop, it. boop, boop, boop. Okay. okay. That's only in a three-player game. In a two-player game, um, there's one per spot, and you just keep rotating them around. Got it. Uh, okay. Hmm. And you're now the starting player. Sure am. Uh, I am going to... Oh, but that person is occupying it. That's the worst. Occupado. Occupado. <laughs> um, okay. I'll go here, and I'll gain three from the bag, if you don't mind. And uh, Chris, you go. Well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to follow a process in this early yeah. game of upgrading. I'll leave it here for now. And I'm going to upgrade this to... Who's the lonely dude who gets to go? It's the guy with the cape. It's what I've been waiting to do. Superman. Yeah. So I'm going to upgrade this guy right here. And then uh, he is going to be upgraded piece. What's this mean again? Uh, you gain two workers. Mm. Yeah. But they have, to place, have to have a place to sleep. Correct. Mm. That's the problem. So instead of feed your people, it's... Bed your people. It's bed your game. people. Yep. Yeah. Got it. Hoiga boiga boiga. All right. Let's see here. Um, What'd you end up doing? You went. You went to your spot. You went to yeah. my upgrade. Spot. Yeah. Yeah. Upgrade. You them. could. So you could actually upgrade not just that character. You upgrade anyone on the board. Oh really? Yeah. So you could upgrade this guy. Oh, interesting. Yeah. So I could have him here, but this guy's upgraded and still gets to go be played. Mm -hmm. All right, I'll just do that. It doesn't make a major impact on this turn, yeah. But that's good to know. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna play this card and spend all my mistletoe. Oh, I can't do that. It's blocked. Darn it. All right, that's that spot. Yeah. Well, you could spend another worker yeah. to do it. Mm. So you would go there, yeah. and then you would spend the second one over there. Oh, that's so funny, because I thought the spot I was going to was the block one. kind of want to upgrade. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to do it. Okay. All right, so one goes here, and one goes here? Yep. All right, spend all six. And then I could upgrade only this guy, or I could still upgrade one of these two people? Uh, you could upgrade a a any of those three, but the thing is, the dwelling that he's in, I don't know if you need to move him immediately, so I'll, I'll, I'll look that up while... Oh, yeah, I go next, right? Oh, I gotcha. Uh, so when you upgrade, uh, you first choose the druid. Um, if it was an active druid, yeah. Only some resting places. Uh, oh, so you would just move it to the resting place it would go to. 
Okay. Yeah, so I can upgrade them and slide them over, basically. Yep. Yeah. All right. So I want to get this. If I understand it. Natural thingy. Carry some extra stuff. Nice. Kind of. All right. Zoop. Okay. Uh. Yeah, I'm gonna need that. So let's. I'm gonna go here. And spend the four stone to get me another card. So I need those things, those three. Yeah, my, I'm, 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 uh, brown. oh yeah. Thank you. I'm just gonna separate these if you guys. Don't yeah, yeah, no. The, that's not confusing. Yeah. Uh, I'm up. So yeah, my decision's pretty clear. Where's the two two new people spots? That's what I want to go to. The two new people spots at the stone area and so the one stone. stone. One stone. Mm -hmm. Three stone. Right. Oh, well, yes. Oh yeah, but the one stone the spot. One. Yeah, it's yeah. The one spot though. Yeah. So yeah. I'm gonna go here. Me and my um, really awesome cape. Uh, I'm just gonna. It's not that great. It's pretty awesome. That's all right. We're gonna go here. I'm gonna get two more people. Uh -huh. And they can go on my board. And this has been spent, and I'm putting it horizontally to reflect that. Oh, look at you. Okay. I think. This one. Here you go. I think there's something brewing here. Uh oh. Right? Oh. I think. Let's see here. We got puns now. Yeah. Well, yeah, right? Because... All right, so this the second rock spot is going to cost me three three rocks. rocks. Right? And then I can go right now. Mm-hmm. And that guy, what, one less ingredient yep. to make a potion? Yep. Okay. So I can get this for only these two items. Is that That's correct? That's correct. Okay. You're the first to get the ancient. Did you go in the bag? I don't know. Okay. Uh, just I guess we we'll put them we'll put a discard. So you get a potion token. To check mark. Thank you. That you got a potion. And you get an ancient. Do I take this off? No, it stays there. It stays there. Okay. Those are there for all of us the entire game. Yeah. So I put this on. I can put this on this person who's already on the board. You can. Okay. But the problem is. Nope. No problem because your guy comes with his own house. Oh, that's right. The tree man. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> That's why he's the best. That's awesome. <laughs> uh, okay. Dude, that's my turn. That was pretty nice. Good job. Uh, okay. Well, I am going to go to the first mistletoe spot right over there. So I will spend three mistletoe to look in the bag for any ingredient I would like. And I for sure am going to... Try to build my own handsome fella. Oh, I have any feathers for that guy. Where are those? I'm trying to oh, right address or something. No. No uh, fancy address. That. Let me drop this on the floor. Can you... Which symbol is the one to... Oh, here it is. The symbols are right on the board. They did a really good job with the symbols on these. Yeah. They did a really, really good job. Oh, yeah. Totally. Have you gone? Yes. I believe then that I'm going to take this person and I'm going to go to the second spot here. I'm going to spend. Oh, yeah, the return to the bag. I'm going to spend five and that is going to get me a spot. No, that's not one of those. It's one of. Which one are you taking? It's the top thing. What do I take for that? That card. It's it's double sided, so take that the the shrine card. The top one. Oh, this one. Yeah, and I flip it over. Okay, and then whatever I put up, does it? Oh, and it has different types. Mm -hmm. there. So you can have a regs or a non regs. I'm definitely have a non regs. Okay, so that's going to give you two points. Okay. Cool. I'm gonna house these people so they can stay with me. You know. Yeah, I get it. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm going to spend here, oh, I only have, oh, yeah, all right, 
right, I'm going to do the bottom action here. So I'm going to spend three feathers mm -hmm. to climb the tree. Nice. So I go on this feather spot. Yep. Getting two, two points. points. Great job. See, the tree is both literal and spiritual. Yeah. You're, you're physically climbing it. Yeah. But then life's journey has many branches. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, very deep. <laughs> I'm gonna go to my own brew a potion spot, and I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, convert one of my guys into uh, Bullwinkle. So let's. <laughs> I'll do it in this spot too. So we're like twinsies. Oh, we're we gonna have like an antler battle. Yeah. <laughs> like part. Yeah, like buck heads. Right. Uh, can you get me his little house? Thank you. you take his house. Okay. Uh, it is my turn. And I believe what I will be doing. I believe what I will be doing. Oh, I could do that too. That would be kind of. This jealous. is pleasant. You could continue to be jealous that you're the only person. No, I'm not jealous is. at all. I got I. You I, have to I, wear an actual hat to make up for it. I, have a, I, <laughs> I also predict I'm the one most likely to have hair in twenty years. So that's your wow! Concern. Wow! Low blow. <laughs> I'll have uh, hair, just maybe not on my head. I'm a, well, my face, right? I'm going to play this. I get to play one feather, according to this. And climb up. This climb up. Any I believe it's any. And I'll double check it's not I'll every. I can't imagine it's every, because the one on the bottom, if it's every. Choose which one you're going to climb, and I'll tell you right now. I'll tell you in a minute. Uh, it is... Well, it's this one for sure. But on any oak branch. Any. Okay. Any. I'm gonna go here. Can I go You're same passing. spot? No, can I go same spot? Yes. Wait, you still get are you feather? If you're going feather, you have to go this way. Yeah, I'm feather. Yeah, okay, so oh yeah, you're you're teal. Yeah, you, you Oh no, this stays here. Right. And he's teal. So. Right, those cross those climb the trees. Do I still get the victory points of you two? You do. You get okay. two victory points. And keep <coughs> in mind you're on the cusp of crossing. I know. Mm. Okay. Don't worry about all right, all right, mm -hmm. all right. Just saying, just Don't saying. Worry. All right. Okay, that's my turn. All right. Well, I'm at a cards once again, so it looks like I'll be passing. So take your passive. So I'll take. Oh, this and this should be here. this one. And then, now, this two for one thing is. I forgot to spend these, by the way. I should do that. They have to be the same ingredient, or they could be no, could be any. Thing? Yeah. Okay. All right, well. And it's at any time. I'll take another mushroom. Yeah. Now, most you can have, member uh, is one one uh, antler dude. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Each elder is unique. So if you're going for that one, just letting you know. No, I don't really have blocking. a reason. I, I dig it. it. I dig it. Um, okay. So I'm going to spend three feather, and we're going to climb the feather track. So I go here. Gain two points and try to catch him. Okay. And then it's my turn? Yep. That's true. Um, hold on, by the way. I apologize. It's this card that I played. I don't want to mix that up. Um, Here we go. I think what Asterisk. I'm gonna, I think what I'm going to do... It recorded, though. <laughs> Rewind the tape. Uh, instead, what I actually am going to do is hold on to this. I'm going to move this piece right yeah. here. Take me down a point. Uh -huh. And I'm going to go mm. up six feathers, so I'm up at eight feathers. Hey, okay, Anthony. So you're passing. Pass your passy. Yep. Uh, I am... Yeah, I feel like that's the right move. So I'm going to actually spend four ingredients to get two resources to have two bumps on, the, on that track. Mm -hmm. So I'll do one, two... Three and four. And then I'm going to spend three so I can climb up that track right over there. And I'll gain two points. Okay. And then I, I still have this guy who can go even wherever one of you have been. So that's the nice thing about it. But no one's in the feather space. But... Hypothetically, I could spend six feathers to get another card of mine, I believe, is the blue card. Yeah. And I could have five cards going into the next round. 
Mm -hmm. which would be advantageous. Plus, whatever card you'll get, you could play again to climb up on one of these trees if you'd like. Right. So, hypothetically, well, that's true. So, I'm going to do that. I'm going to spend, I'm actually going to do that. I'm going to spend six. So, I'm back down to two. But I'm going to get another card. Yeah. I'm playing the card game here. Oh, man, I could do this through exchange. That's only three to get uh, an Ozil. That's nice. Um, oh. But the key thing here is what do I have left? I'm going to take the stone one. Because, yeah. All right, my turn's done. Yeah, you get to pass. Yep, I too shall pass. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not passing. Hang on, before you climb up that tree, I'm trying to figure out when you do. Uh, so when you climb up, uh, you're going to... Okay. Because I don't know when you gain your victory points, if it's before or after. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if you climb this one or this one, you're going to trigger the solstice, which means you'll get an 11. Right, but I'm not going to because I'm going to go up the stone. Perfect. So I'm not going to be triggering the solstice. Okay. So, spend three stone, and you get to go there, and you get two VP. Yeah, so I'm going to be past it. You're going to be past it. There's no... But I, I think it's worth to have one on every spot at this point, so... But you're not going to get any income. What? Because, because you did that, you won't get income from this. Oh. That's the trade-off. So, how much income would I be getting next round? Uh, if you stayed here, right, yeah. you're going to gain three of each, plus you're going to gain one feather and one mistletoe. So four feather, four mistletoe, and three stone. Oh, I get instead of three. Top two. Yeah. Because I'd still get the three, normal three, right? Yeah. No, I think I would do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna still do it. Were you on ten or nine? I was on nine. You were on nine, right? Okay. Yeah, yeah I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go up. Okay. So you're going up? Yeah, I'd like to move up this tree. Alright. Move up that tree. Cool. Anthony gets a pass and now the resources are gone so sorry and i've passed and i'm assuming you're passing yeah. so that's it hooray <laughs> Don't now sorry. we can take our people back off the board well we got yeah take your people off the board uh so one two three four so this guy goes there you this can go live here, here cape man cape man cape man Faster than the <laughs> ruler of the sun. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. Um, now, if there's anyone on keys, we would activate it. Get your cards back. Yep. We'll refill the ingredients in the forest. Probably. Must be my seven. One, two, three. <laughs> Is it? I don't know. <laughs> I'm playing a completely different st strategy here, obviously. I have zero strategy right now. I like it. I like it. Um, I'm playing a completely different... We're going to advance the solstice marker. So now we get to feast. Yeah. So, so I, I get I, a feather. Because I'm equal with it, I don't get it. You're not equal. See, you're, you're ahead, ahead of it. Ahead of it. Oh, I am ahead it's, of it. It's in the it's middle. It's like 10.5. Oh, the angles. Yeah. The angles. Yeah. So I'm going to gain one feather, and I'm going to gain one stone. You are going to gain one feather and one stone as well. I still get, we, then we still gain all the plus three that we normally would get, right? Uh, we, we haven't gotten to that point yet. Okay. It's just the solstice. This passes on. You're going to start player. <coughs> cool. Turn three. Now we start with the dawn. Everyone gets three of each resource. One. Okay. I can do with that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Plenty of stone. Mm -hmm. Start it off. Mm -hmm. All right. I got some people. Plenty of people here. Um, hmm. What I got? The oh, sorry. This person moves over here. The th the three player. And then mm -hmm. that makes it cost mm -hmm. one less. This means. Hold on, I'm going for all of these. Oh, uh, would you mind them. giving me a victor uh, a check potion? Yes. I never got go. one. Thank you. Oh, let's see. So I'm trying to double check one thing that people I haven't upgraded to yet. The satchel guy gets me. Cost you one less. Cost me one ingredient. less to get brew a potion. Mm -hmm. The other side thing gets me. Um, 
one of these, so mm-hmm. it's an extra spot for creatures, really. Yep. Not people. Right. Um, and then... What's this one? Which one? That's the satchel. Oh, no, this one. And then this one. Well, you spend a... two less re- uh, resources when going on a spot. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm going to do this. I'm going to upgrade. Oh, I never moved. Okay. Hold on. Could I have not kept that one then? Hold on. Oh, you have too many people? Do I have too many people? It looks like you have too many people. So this guy was go back into the yep. fort. That's all. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to upgrade, and I'm going to make this person this one. Nice. Hmm. And he's still useful for me. Hmm, 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 hmm. What is a that top right thing again? In this one, yeah. the shrine. Okay. So you spend three of each resource. Only an elder can go there. Right. And it's six victory points, and it has to go in one of these top slots. Got it. And it counts towards his victory point condition, which is pretty nice. I'm gonna do that. I think. Yeah. Uh, three of each though. Mm-hmm. That kind of limit me for the rest of the Now, nah. this one, if you have this, you right. could spend three less of any resource when building those. So you're basically just spending six, six instead of nine. Correct. And are all the creatures typically, it looks like, three victory points? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I know there's one that's five, and there's one, I think, that's six. Mm. All right, all right. Maybe at any rate. Mm-hmm. All right, so I'm going to move my satchel guy there to my single spot, which lets me take one of those cards, and I'm going to take that top one there. This one? Yep. Okay. Faishan. Oh, he's got a cat of nine tails. Yeah. And possibly one leg. Interesting. Hmm. And you get three points. Three points. I do, I do. Uh, you are purple. You're going up to ten. A new card comes out. It is Slug Namarb. And is that uh, one of... And this is, you could change a feather, you can use a feather to either a mistletoe or a... Or a okay, so it means yeah. feathers are worth more yeah. value. May I go? Yeah. I mean, it's good for you, Mr. Feathers. I know, I'm, I'm very well aware <laughs> of that. Mr. Feathers. <laughs> um, okay, so I'm going to play this card. Send out this person right there. And I'm going to spend three stone to gain two people. Does this mean any resource? Uh, I think so. Okay, cool. Any ingredient. Yeah, any ingredient, yeah. All right. So, speaking of, what is the symbol for those cards? <laughs> Which cards? The, those over there. What is? What am I looking for? This blue. The back of it looks like the Yes, it's the, the blue. The blue, blue, the blue, the blue, the blue. The blooms. I don't have enough of the feathers, ironically. <laughs> Go figure. Maybe I could get more feathers. Get more feathers. Oh, yeah. I got to take another hit. Which actually might not be the worst thing right now. Um, Believe in you. But I kind of like that ability to change a feather into anything. So. It is nice. I think I. Th- th- there's a problem with it, too. But, um, or there's something I want to do. But I think mm-hmm. I'm going to do that. Uh, in the long run. So let me... Actually, you know what? Let me abandon that goal. Um, what I'm actually going to do, I think, is look up at that tree right now. Mm-hmm. Um, I don't need directions of that. I think what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take this this friendly worker. I'm going to do just that. Take me down to... Uh, to Victor. Actually... Hold on, don't do that because that would up me six, so that would be a waste. That's a waste because you have most. That would be a complete waste. Um, So what I'm actually going to do is go a different direction. I think what I'm going to do is there's no cheaper way to buy those. Wait a minute. Wait a second. That would be another one of those spots, which might be useful. Um, Think about that. Flip up and there's just some decision making here that I'm going to make. Um, I think what I'm actually going to do instead is take 
since I didn't move him there, I'm actually going to take him and I'm going to put him in the first, oh, the feather spot. Never mind. That's not an issue. I'm going to put this guy here mm -hmm. because he can go there. Where? He can go to there? this first feather spot. Oh, nice. At no cost. Extra yep, cost. No extra cost. And then <laughs> that's going to allow me to move this to Over. that spot. Nice. Remember, you can also just spend the resources. Oh, I know. Okay. But that only cost me one. That's true. And I can go to that spot. That's true. So so you just basically Did scare people away with your boop, boop. dead bird stick. Yeah, yeah, my dead bird oh, stick. Oh, the creepy guy is here again. Dead Get parrot. out of this. Oh, that creepy Did you spend the resource? Uh, yeah. Spend that feather. Zerba derba. Zerba. Oh, yeah, I have no clue what to do. I believe in you. Just thrilling. But that means if someone else wants to go there, they have to pay three workers. Mm hmm. Three workers to go there now. No, it's always just one. It's always just one extra. Yeah. Okay. There's not like a multiplication. Yeah, it's not cumulative. Nice try, though. No, I'm just. It's a legitimate question. I wasn't no. sure. Oh, I know. I don't even know if there's a strategy there. You know. Oh, there is. I don't know. <laughs> just. Now what is this again? This is a place to live? Yeah. If you've got Cape Man. Cape. Only Cape Man can live there? Yeah. Cape Man can live there alone because he's a loser. Cape Man. How dare you? Alone. But that means that this person can go there also. No. He no. has his own tree. Yeah. Cape Man has oh, no friends. Job. He likes to, right. to live alone. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. I think... I'm going to send... This person, no, I can send this person to this spot, right? Mm hmm. Because he pretends like he has the dead bird stick too. Mm hmm. Okay, and I can get two peeps, right? Well done. That's correct. And they could go here and here. Yep. For now. Yep. You're about to be homeless, so sorry. And you spend less resources for that too. <clears throat> for the what now? How many you have that card, right? That the ancient the ancient spends two less resources. Oh, so it cost me two. Yeah, as a thank you. I forgot this move. Yeah, how, how much did that cost you normally? Uh, it cost you three. Yeah. So it should only cost you one. Boop. Yeah. See, there you go. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna use my bullwinkle. I'll go right here, and I'm gonna spend one. Yeah, I like that. And now um. Can I get one of those uh, shrines? Thank you. And I will do it for... They're all the same, side. right? Yeah, they're all the same. I'm going to gain two VP. Okay. Okay, your turn. All right, I think what I'm going to do is keep whittling down my feathers. So I'm going to spend one feather. The feather man can. And <laughs> spend one feather have to go to the stone section oh no i can't do it it's kind of crowded oh, over no. there i can't do it hold on well no i won't do it. i won't spend any feathers whatsoever you don't spend those feathers no i can't do that either damn it hold on just pluck some more off one of those dead birds you have on your stick oh wait that guy's already occupied never mind no no i can still do this and it will still work functionally for me so i'm gonna just do it um, I'm going to spend instead three feathers. Mm -hmm. And that is going to allow me to do the bottom move action without moving people. So I'm going to take my dude up the feather track here. Oh, nice. He's going to go there. So you gain two VP. Yep. The solstice marker advances. So I'll remove this. Yep. Nice. Good job. Oh, I see. So you can either go this way or this way from here. Correct. You yeah. can guess directions I want to go. Are right, you done? Yeah. All right. Uh, me thinks I'm going to climb as well. So I'm going to spend three fetters. Oh, no. Everyone's climbing. And am I already on that track? Yeah, right. Everyone's climbing. So now where do I go? I go... You go, you go on top of mine right now. Mm-hmm. 
Right here? Yep. Okay. So you gain two points. <clears throat> we remove this. This is this will now trigger a solstice will happen. Ooh. So we're all gonna gain Sweet. stuff. Uh so you're gonna gain two feathers. Me? Yep. Both of us. And right? Yeah, both of you will gain two feathers. Okay. Um I'm gonna gain one feather. Uh Teal's gonna gain one mistletoe. Whoops. Okay. And then everyone is gonna gain one one rock. Okay. One rock. What do you mm -hmm. rock with that? There you go. Treat. That's my turn. That was sweet. Don't wear it out. I won't. Uh, yeah, I think what I'll do. I'm gonna. Yeah, that's nice. Does this mean like this one? Does mean I can play it again? Was it? No. Oh, so you could play an, one of your cards that you previously played, okay. but without putting the person out? Yeah, that's what I thought. Or spending the resources. Because you already spent six resources in putting a person out to do whatever you want to do. Right, right. It's pretty nice. But So essentially, I spend six, and I can either take one out and just do the action again. Of one of the cards you played already. Right, this any of these. Right. Yeah. Um, okay. This is interesting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, I think. Oh, that would have been nice. I like how we've all played it completely different, though. So far, yeah. Than yeah. so far. There's it's, definitely a lot of choices. There's a lot of variables in the way you can right. kind of decide to move. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to discard two resources. <clears throat> Gonna increase my feather from five to six. You can do that as many times as you want, as long as you have the ingredients. You said you just discard two uh, two ingredients okay. for for one. Um, and I'm gonna move this guy. Uh, there's a lot going on in my head. Here. Um, I'm gonna spend one mistletoe and discard all three of these. How? Be gone, creatures of the forest. Ew. You have displeased the orange druids. Ooh. So, mistletoe equals stone Change and feather. That's cool. Uh, what is that? Yan. Upgrade equals... So, the rune temple action, this thing, uh, you may pay one extra rune to perform the oak action as well. Oh. That's so you pretty... can go there, spend an extra rune to go up the tree. Rune to go up the tree. Ooh, that's pretty powerful. That is pretty right. nice. Um, and then this one, number 28, uh, Leonon's Seed. You, when recruiting a druid, you may also gather an ingredient from the forest without placing a passive druid. Oh, hmm. nice. Okay, taking this one. <laughs> it's a pretty easy choice there. Pretty easy choice there. It's going to be three points. One, two, and three. Okay. All right. I'm digging this. So now I can hypothetically now play this. I can place one of my workers in the three stone area, or the third stone area. Yep. Spend six stone. Take this down to two. And now I can take one of these cards and play any of the actions from it again. Correct. Mm -hmm. And without paying a cost at this Correct. point. Correct. So, or the worker. Right now. The, right now. Wow. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back up that tree one more time. I don't know if you can do that, though. Okay. I think you have to actually treat it as a... Well, no, it's one of my actions. Oh, then perfect. Yes. <laughs> it's one of my actions. I, I, thought you're doing, I thought you are doing the bottom part. No, no, I know I can do it. Um, then by all means. So go there. Okay. You gain two VP. And a feather? Nope. Or, or during no, that's just during that the piece. solstice, you get okay. one feather. No. So two VP. Two VP. Where did you learn to climb trees like that? I I am really Watch nimble. a lot of Jurassic Park. <laughs> right? Really does that part <laughs> and climb trees. Really freaking nimble. Yeah. All right. Nimble little <laughs> minx and she. I think I have a plan. I think. You think? I'm changing all six of my ingredients to get three more mistletoe. Mm-hmm. 
it put me up to six. This is like I forgot opposite. to spend this, by the way. This is like the opposite of Lost Runes of Arnak, where I'm not getting up the, the damn path nearly at all. <laughs> and yelling at myself. Oh, wait. I, I didn't put them in the back yet. I can't do that, can I? Oh, wait. Does this let me go to a place that someone already is? Is that what this weasel is? Um, so if you're on if you're on the first or third spot of a sp particular region, you can treat it as if it were the second. Yeah. So like if you're here or here, you right. can treat it as if you were here. So that's not what I, I can't do that. Then I was looking to upgrade, but I can't. You want this stuff? Yeah. Oh, man. Wait, why why can't you do it? Right, because I can't go. There's this one. This one. It's the mistletoe spot. The mistletoe. No one's there. It's free oh, rain. Oh, da da da. Yes, my yes. bad, my bad. I was looking at the wrong track. All right, so yeah, take those back. Okay. I'm gonna play that. So you got this to get three mistletoe. To get and then three you get mistletoe. Six. Perfect. And now I'm going. Yep. Perfect. Here. So you spend six. Spend all six. You can upgrade one of these guys. Give this guy a cape. There you go. He goes into his little hut. Zoop. Rest peacefully. There you go, druid. <laughs> uh, okay. I am gonna go right over here to make a potion. Oh. Can I have one of the potion markers? And I am going to get nine mistletoe. Okay, your turn. Oh, I'm just reading what my one guy does again. Oh, I paid less with him. Okay. Less with him. That's not bad. I pay more. Um, I think I know what I would love to do, but I just don't think I can do it. Um... Get more people, but that's kind of useless at this point. I've got these two people left here. Cape Man needs to go out somewhere, I guess. Um, oh, this one gets the ingredients. Oh, crud. Am I not allowed to have this because this is here? Put it right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. But normally that would Normally be that's correct. Got it, okay. So hypothetically, this would... This one, if I play three... I get to pull ingredients from the bag. This one of the stone ones, I, I can't do anything at the stone. You get to look what ingredient you want, too. That's what the eyeball needs. Right. Hypothetically, that's actually what I think I'd like to do. Mm -hmm. But, I, I, yeah, I think that's what I'd like to do. So, I could, but that's, so that's the mistletoe. So that costs me three. Mm -hmm. Except it's only going to cost me one because I'm going to use this guy. All right, good. gets the discount. And he gets a discount. And I think I'm good here. Yep. And so I get to go into the bag. Mm -hmm. And take one that you want in particular. Yeah. I mean, honestly, I've only got a stupid thing. It really doesn't matter. Would you get I a pull. discount on? How many mistletoe it costs to go there? Yeah. Well, it's just only one cost, right? With that, right. It's yeah, one cost. that's pretty nice. Yeah. Let's take one of those. Um, yeah, that's okay. with this one. All right, so I have to pass, right? Hey, we have like all the same ones. Because I have no cards left. Um, Because this guy can't do anything, right? Yeah, that guy and that guy unfortunately can't. Well, this one, you could build a shrine. Mm. Um... No. Oh, yeah, you can with your this person, right? You spend three, you spend so three. So it costs three here and three here. Mm -hmm. All right, so that's four and that's zero. Yeah, and you go all the way up, and it's reserved for your player color. Oh, how about that? So you get a shrine. Thank you. Six points. That's a big jump. You're now nice. in the lead at 18. Now where does this go? Uh, on the top. So you choose if you want to put it there or there. Drop of the microphone. That doesn't matter. Uh, okay. My go. So I got a couple options. Uh, I can. Talking down. My go. My go. Uh, that one's going there. This one is his own hut. Okay, so I have room for one of these two. So let's go here. Upgrading. I'm gonna spend two victory points. I'm gonna upgrade. Uh, I 
think I want the discount one. I like the discount. So discount one's gonna go right there. Okay, Paris. All right, well, there's not a ton I can do. I could get another, no, I don't have enough to get another, I don't have enough to do it. Um, I could do the trade for the thistle, get myself enough to do something on this one, right? I could take this down to two. Mm-hmm. And then bring that up to three. Yeah, you could trade one to one. With yeah, that. I think I'll do that. I think I'm going to take another pot. What spot are you going to for that one? Um, you do a spot to do that now? Oh, that's a spot to... Yeah, I can't even do it, probably. Yeah. Um, but I... I Adjust I'm, it back. No, I'm still doing oh. it. Oh, you are? Okay. Because I'm going to do the bottom action. Which is three to go up on the tree. Okay. So go that going up on the tree and then going up on this that tree? side, I guess, now. So yeah. I go here. Mm -hmm. and that's two victory points. Two victory points. And we advance yeah. the solstice marker. Yeah. That's what we're going to have to do. Okay. And then spend, the spend your stuff. And I spent three stuff. And did you adjust your missile tower or no? Mistletoe was just, it was at four. It was at four. It was at four, I brought it to two. Because you said I spent two to get one. No, 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 no. It's two of, of ingredients. Oh, crap. So never mind, I can't do that then, I guess. Because I was, this was at two, so take that back, I guess. Is there anything I can do then with this card? I don't know if there's anything I can do. I can... You don't have any ingredient tokens? And actually... What I... about those two? I do have ingredient tokens. Actually, you could discard those two to go up. If you want. I mean, what's the thing there? The pot and then the, what's that other one? This one? No, the other one. For everyone I... Every artifact. It's three points. I mean, I don't, you know what? But I'd rather just get an artifact. So can I do nothing? Can I just decide to be done? And yeah. Play the card? To pass. I don't really think it's to my advantage to play anything right now. I mean, I think the tree's a nice one, but but it's up to you. You know what? The, the I'm not doing much with these pots anyway, so why don't you do this? Put it back in the bag. Put it back and... in the bag. I'll do this, and then it got to three, and then it went down to zero, and then this went to two. And then I'll do that again. Why not go to two? Because it was at four. Oh, I'm sorry. No, that stays. That, sorry. It stays just, at four. It stays at four. Sorry. I'm confusing that. That's okay. And that one's there. Okay. So you gain two VP. This goes away. The solstice in advances. We we had moved it back probably right. So no, I didn't. I, it goes there, I think, yeah. right? Because it's yeah, yeah. Because it's been advanced a total of three times, right? Yep. One, two, and three, and then round two, round three. We're good. Mm -hmm. Right. All right. I'm passing. I'm taking one of these people right now. I'll take this right now. Um. Doing this, spending three, going up on the green tree. Okay. Okay. I'm Pass. passing. You're passing. So you put your guy there. You take I the ingredient. Will take this. Yeah, I'll take that. You're passing. Passing. You take an ingredient. And that's it. Because we're out of people. Right. So uh, we bring our workers back. Oh, wait, I still have this worker. I'm going to use this worker. So you didn't pass? No, I didn't pass yet. Okay. Yeah. All right. I didn't pass yet. Now. Yeah. 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 Wait, okay. does, I can go here. You said when this is empty, does it automatically end the round? Oh, and when everyone passes. Oh, okay. And okay, it's okay. empty. Got it. Yeah. So I'm going here. I get three ingredients in the bag. Oh, you have two three ingredients? Yeah. spots there. Mm. How many of these boards are there? Just one for each Just five. So I, I dealt them at random. Yeah, yeah. But uh, normally, uh, each player is going to decide one and then pass it along. Is there something on the other side? There's not. Okay. Oh, that would have been cool. But There's, uh, this way you could shuffle, I guess, right? Oh, uh, good point. Yeah. Okay. So now you pass. Now we take pass. our pizzas. I pass. Yeah. Pizzas? Pizzas. Pizzas, pizzas. pizzas here. <laughs> All right, so this... Okay. Yeah, so you good. can sleep in there. And you go back yeah. to your treehouse. That's there. Now that, that guy stays up there? Superman? No, no, Superman comes okay. back. All right. 
he can stay in his super hut. <laughs> Fortress of Solitude. And... Okay. Okay, so I think I do not have a house for this person. So he goes here? Yeah. Okay. Along with these. Those. And this goes there. And that. Great. Um, now, if anyone's on a key, we advance the key. Everyone gets their cards back. Right. We refill the ingredients. I'll do so it. I'll just add three. We advance the solstice marker. A solstice is triggered. We're all going to gain some stuff. Um, so I'll walk you through what we're gaining. Like stuff. You're going to gain one feather. I'm going to gain one feather. Both of us are going to gain one mistletoe. Okay. Both of us will gain one stone. I gain two stone. You gain two stone. Okay. Okay. Uh, the first player marker passes. It's already got to you. Yep. We're in turn four of five. We're almost done. And now we go back <coughs> into income. Everyone collects three resources. Okay. All right. And now you start it off. It's going on a nice clip, too. No, this is decent. Yeah. Now that I know what I'm doing. Yeah. I had a little bit of AP or two on one of those yeah. turns, but now I have a. Now I tend to have an ebb and flow of what I I like know the what... balance, too, of like deciding do I want to use. Oh, look, oh this, and this worth... person moves again, right? Oh, yes. Thank you. No. And this is worth five victory points. Ooh. It's just flat out five victory points. Because it's yeah. on fire. Yeah. Well, that is attractive. What to do, what to do. Hmm. Which gives you extra cards? Oh, the bottom mm -hmm. three stone spot, right? Yeah. I do like how like certain cards up the upgrade might simply be cheaper. Mm -hmm. Or cheaper than like what's on another card. Yeah, they did a good job with that. They're pretty well balanced. Yeah. Sorry, what's Superman's advantage again? Superman starts in his own spot. That's it? So that's he's it. never... That's, yeah, his, always that's all he does. Okay. Yeah. Alright, so then, I'm going to go to this spot right now. I'm going to spend me four stones. That's a good spot. And I would like a new okay. purple card. Please. Yeah, that's a really good spot. Thank you. Da, 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 da. I can't imagine. I actually heard that song today. <laughs> did you? Yeah, I did. I, just, I forget how like unique I Sammy Davis's imagine. voice okay. is. Like, uh, Ooh, take the sunshine. Crazy. All right. Uh... <laughs> I'm going to send this worker out over here and spend one stone to gain. Can you give me that, if you don't mind, the shrine cards? Thank you. And I will gain two victory points. Catching up. Okay. So I think what I'm going to do I don't know why I keep forgetting what this one symbol means. Hmm? Oh, okay, I keep forgetting everything. That one is you just take a worker from here and put Okay, it that's all it is. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for the clarification. You're welcome. Um I think what I'm going to do is take a fairly straightforward action. Mm hmm um, but I gotta find where the card for it is, because um, I know it's one of these, mm. um, and I do not know where the hell I put it. I thought one of my guys was up on top of in that first. This one? No. Oh yeah, they were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. they were. They passed this line because yeah. it triggered this. Both yeah. of them. Okay. Yeah. So gain two feathers. All right. So I. Think... I don't believe there was one of yours here, though. No, no, no. I don't yeah. think so either. I so. What I am going to do, and can I upgrade a person who's already on the board? Yes. Down the line? Okay. Just want to clarify that. So I'm going to play the feather action. The feather action of the third area. Yeah. 
and I'm going to upgrade one of my pieces. Okay. I'm going to upgrade to, let's do, what's more useful? You know what? Let's do, what is this side thing? I mean, you can do whatever else in the meantime. Oh, the satchel, this gets just another spot. Yeah, it's an additional board to the side. That one, one less ingredient for building. Uh, potions. Yeah, I want to put you here. Okay, so you gain one of the boards, the yeah. bard board. Yeah, that's, this is, I'm going to do Singing. That. Bar board. Boom, boom, boom. It's like a little bonfire. Yeah. Singing some songs. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I recognize that. All right, cool. Time's up, Gonzo. Yeah. My turn is done. Ish, ish, ish. Uh... Okay. Well, well, well. I'll go. Dice. Where's this stats? And I'm just going to note that that put me down to three feathers for everybody. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, I am going to trade in these two ingredients. Let's step right back here. Take those. Por favor. And <clears throat> make it into a feather. So now I've got six feathers, which means I can go to... Oh, actually... Oh, no, that's for brewing. Never mind. Go to that second spot, and I'm gonna get that five pointer. Nice. Well, ah, I can't. Darn yeah. it. All right, how do I move this? <laughs> You'd spend three stone. Okay, so I can do it. You can do it. Yeah. Got it. All right, that goes there. Yeah. Okay. okay. Thank you. Yeah. You need five VP. Fire. Flying. Well, that guy looks like he's in trouble. Yeah. It's like wearing a diaper. A diaper, he's got like weird Bogart. hands. Bogart, what's he do? You place uh, him, and then you can. And the second, <laughs> second, and third spot is treated as the first, okay? Yeah, because it's Bogart. Spooky, your turn, sir. Uh, we're gonna move here, so I'm gonna go down three victory points. That's not fun. One, two, three, but I'm gonna upgrade, which is fun. This one right here, the little, little creepy bird. Piggy bird, piggy bird. And now you're up. Alright. I am going to take my little... Mm-hmm. I'm going to go over here. Upgrade. Mm-hmm. That's your last one, right? Uh, outside of the Elder, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Mm, awkward. It's like the last <laughs> one. That well, is my turn. Well, well, okay. well, 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 You got a messenger bag one. It's not as cool, but, you know, I got a cool bag, I guess. I got a banjo or got something some on the side in of me. There. Good. No, it's a musical instrument. It's whatever you want it to be. No, it's oh. clearly a musical instrument. Oh, that one is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's very clearly. A no, this one. Oh, this that one. one. The messenger yeah, he's got bag. A bag. Yeah, that guy's got the messenger bag. All right, I think Superman is going to go over to this spot, and I'm going to grab Bogart. I can't nice. grab Bogart for the same reason that I couldn't do it before, because I didn't move that. Never mind, I'm not doing that. Never you mind, Bogart. Does I'll the get ancient to you. count as an elder? Yeah. Okay. Ancients are the elder. Mm. Right. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What have you been doing to get three goods, though? Is that one of your things? Mm -hmm. Is that that action you just take three goods out of a bag? Which one? That one. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, really. That was nice. That was look, you say that, but look where I am. No, right. I know. I, know. I, I get that. I'm just... Do you? <laughs> I'm still coming to terms with it. It's about balance. Don't have four of those. What does this do? Just change something into something else? Yeah. Hmm. Just the trade. 
Sometimes it's good. Well then. All right, I'm gonna do a little climby climby, I think. So I spent three mistletoe. You're going up the green track? Go up the green track. Okay. And two VP. Mm. All right. Look at you. Look at me. Okay. All right. Rune boy. Spending two rune. Let's go there. Oh, do I want to spend two? Or do I want to... Yeah, spend two. Spend two. I'll go there. And then gain one of my cards. Can you hand me those cards? They're over there in that section. No, no. Thank you. Here you go. Okay. All right. Exciting times. Exciting times. Sure is, Cap. All right. So, I think what I'd like to do. I don't know if that's worth it. I do not know if it's worth it. Though, that might be worth it. That would be worth it if I can do it. But how I could do it. I think I could. Could you? Would you? Should you? I can do it. So I'm going to play this. This is going to cost me four stone. But I'm going to take this guy who can go anywhere. Because he's like, Caca! Caca! My stick scares you away. He looks like yeah, Moon Knight. And then he goes it's like here. A, it's like, all right, man, just just get away from me. <laughs> He's going there. That cost me four, but I will get my final card. Mm. And this is out. So now I have all the cards. Well, that is something. Ain't it? Okay. So I'm going to spend three feathers to move this over meow. Mm -hmm. So that I can do what I was... Yeah, another one of them. Trying to do before and go here. Yeah. And get Bogart. Oh, man. Get three points. You're at 28. Well, it's okay, buddy. Who's out now? Um, The unicorn. Oh. Oh, boy. The unicorn, when taking ingredients, you don't need to spend the druid Ooh, to take. Oh, Bogart. Why weren't you a unicorn? <laughs> he looks like Mac and me. Yeah, it does kind of oh, like Mac. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's on Mystery Science Theater, by the way. On but the like, season. if Mac and me took like the the Jekyll and Hyde formula, and yeah, then changed. Um, all right. So I'm gonna just get the ingredients in the bag. Can I have the bag? No. Okay. Well, you have no choice. Mm. And is this, this one is just, oh, that's just exchanging whatever to whatever. Got it. I could spend nothing. And I can make this, this, that, that, or that, that. Got it. That, 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 <laughs> that, that, that. All right. My turn? Mm hmm I believe what I will be doing. Believe what I will be doing. Uh, I believe what I will be doing. And this has to flip over. I can take him. Go there. Uh, it's not the right spot. Right here. And I will be taking one of these. Um, that gets me... What are you taking? Oh, an artifact. Yeah, that gets me... Let's see. Any of those cards, which might be the only way I start to get these things. Um, what does that one do? Bodak? No, this lets me repeat an action. Yeah, without yeah, without spending the person or No, I'm taking that. Okay. Four victory points. Oh, a cornucopia. Okay. Alright. I got to pass. Alright. Okay. So Well no, you don't do oh you don't have the unicorn. Sorry, for some reason I was thinking you took the unicorn, but he's still there. Seems like it will be a good fit for me, but I'll yes. have to wait. Um and uh What are these things? What is this? Bark of a tree? What is this? I think so. Useless. Yeah. Right? None of the... None of them have it. Potions have but it. But this can take any. Oh, true. Yeah, but I don't have artifacts anyway. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. All right. 
No, you know what? I'm gonna take a mushroom then. Yeah. Screw you guys. Yeah. Yeah. That'll show us. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna build, pay, make a potion. Can you give me a, a yep. finished potion thing? And I am gonna spend an acorn, which what, can turn into an oak tree one day. So I planted uh. it in there. Uh, and I'm gonna gain nine of a particular resource. Let's gain stone. Okay. Well, I've been saving these feathers. I'm gonna spend three feathers, <coughs> taking the bottom action, and we're going up. Nice. So you don't get points just yet. Okay. But you're getting there. Yeah. You pass, right? I pass, and there's no one left to climb oh. or to gather. The unicorn would have helped. Yep. Sorry. Uh, okay. Well, I'm going to spend... I have cards. You can use the... Well, isn't that nice? <laughs> <laughs> Must be nice. Hey, we only have one person left. Yeah, but I got multiple things I can climb. Mm. <laughs> That's the point. We've all focused on different things. You've brewed things. You've got creatures. I only brewed one things. No, he's oh, brewed yes, things. He brewed You've got creatures. I have a, a menagerie. And I've gone up a tree. So, I'm Bran. <laughs> so, I like climbing. That's right. And that thing has three birds on it. You're like the three-eyed raven. <laughs> I am. Right? Man, I tell you. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go here. So, I'll spend four. I mean, I'm at five. Uh, Wouldn't it be nice? And I'll gain one of these. I don't like any of those, though. So, they're all gonna go away. Clear them out. Just murder them. Yeah. We got three more. But that cost you Whoa. a point, right? Yeah. Oh, we... Okay, when... Placing an elder, you ignore the costs of yeah. additional people. Mm -hmm. oh, during income, I get an ingredient. Hmm. And fake Shrek, <laughs> I get... Oh, whenever I do that, I can climb up the tree. Oh, man. <laughs> I keep forgetting I have that ability. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to buy that one. And I'm going to remember this time, guys. Okay. One, two, three. Sliding that up. Trigger immediately because I did a green one. I don't, I, maybe. I don't know. Maybe. Does it? Does it? Uh. Yeah, I, I don't. I, I don't think so. Wait. Creature cards remain in play and can be used each time they are applicable. If phase action is specified, you may only use the card during that phase action. So during the mistletoe temple action, which I did do. What can I? Can I climb? A tree? Yeah. All yeah. right. I'll spend one to climb a tree. Okay. This worked out well. Then. Except you're standing on our shoulders. I am. I am. That's what I do. Spending two. This happens. Can you, uh, I can't reach the solstice. Past the solstice thing. Yeah, I know. All right. So my turn? Yeah. I'm going to spend... Oh, okay. I'm digging this. Oh, got I'm... a new comment. Yo, yo, what a looker. Gorgeous board. Oh, yeah. thanks. As... This game is great so far. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying it. it. I am. Uh, this is my second play of it, and a lot of synergy. Did um, you win in your solo experience? I did not win in my solo experience. I got trounced. Mm. Is that the proper term? I don't know. It yeah. was 52 to 58, I think. I'm I going to there. spend this action. Uh, I am spending trounced. three... Trounced. Eight down to five, the bottom action of a card, and I am moving up as well. Oh. Okay, so you're going to get two VP. Okay. Add my two VP for me, sir. Advance the, the solstice marker. Uh, we get we get stuff. <laughs> yeah. So purple, you're getting two feathers. Got it. I'm getting one feather. Both you and I... Uh, Chris, get two mistletoe. Two mistletoe. Purple, you get one mistletoe. Mm -hmm. Purple, you get one stone. Mm -hmm. I get one stone. Chris, you get two stone. Okay, did I get any feathers? Nope, because you're at, at the, the end. I was at the end. At the okay. top. All right. You're I'm assuming you're passing. I have, yeah. I, yeah. I, I yeah. Go. So it's your turn. All right. 
I will spend three well, feathers. I have a question. But t- yeah. I can't ghost though, but technically, yeah. if in that Solstice thing I had gotten a resource that now lets me play a card, I can't because I passed already once, or can I like, can I go now? Good question. That's a fair question. Not me. So Consults the rule I, book. I can't, but I was curious if I could. Uh, you situation. may choose to pass. For the remainder of the phase, you're only allowed to gather ingredients. Okay. Sorry. That would be nice, though. Okay. I didn't have them anyway. Your turn. I'm just curious. Okay, my turn? Yeah. No, wait, your turn. I, I went already. Oh, you, you went did. already. Yeah. I'm going to take the action of using this card, spending the bottom portion. I'm spending three. That's three. One, two, three. I'm going to move him up the tree. The question is, what direction do I want to go? That is going to be for every uh, blue card. Creature, yeah. And that's for every potion. potion created. Oh, you know what? This this one stinks. All right. <laughs> um, I guess I'm gonna go for sad. Well, you, could, you could block someone off. Yeah, I I think I'm gonna go for the creature. Uh, no, the potions. The potions. Ah, get away from my potions. Ah, this is a creature. Get away from these creatures. <laughs> I'm gonna go for. You're the... either messing with him or with me. No, but I can actually. <laughs> I feel like I can actually get creatures, so I'm gonna use the. Creatures. Yeah, that makes more sense for you. So that's two victory points for me. Yep. Move yourself up. All right, you pass. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna spend uh, three mistletoe to move up on the mistletoe track, and I'm gonna go the opposite direction. I'm gonna get two VP. That's it. Okay. Uh, I am going to take my worker, put him here, lose a victory, lose a point. Yeah, lose that point. But I get to reuse an action. Yes, from, these artifacts. I, I get to reuse points. an action from any of these cards. Yeah. Because I get to do an action from any of these cards, I'm actually going to move up this track. Oh man. And go and get two more victory points. Wow. Mm-hmm. Someone is cooking. So that's my turn, and I have. I'm done. Yeah. And I'm not gonna be able to do anything. You're done. Oh, it comes back to me. I'm done. I pass. Yeah, but it goes back to me. It goes back to you. I'm going to play this. This spends three. One, two, three. Oh, my I'm gonna goodness. Go up. Oh, Close my that out. Good. <sighs> that's, that's hog in the tree. That is rough. That is a rough tree. Um, okay. You pass. I pass still. You're passing. I can't do anything. So anymore. you pass. You take an ingredient. Oh, I still get an ingredient. And uh, that's it. I guess I'll take, close this out. I guess I'll take this. Okay. That's the round. Holy moly. So what I went the finish. tree approach, clearly, in this game. What a finish. Okay, so first, take your workers back. So the people on the worker spots you're going to take back. Uh, worker spots. Mm-hmm. Oh, my hat. Oh, no. I'm missing someone. Oh, there they are. There they are. <laughs> okay. Great. Oh, man. Get on there. Now, we're going to lock up the keys. So, you're going to gain... Uh, Barrels, you're getting 2 VP per upgraded. How many is that? Uh, 5. So, so 10, 10 points. Mm. Okay, so you're going from 26 to 36. I do not have any of those creatures. So, don't ask me about those. I'm not. Uh... <sighs> Yeah, that's awkward. You should have gone the other way. You would have screwed me over. I know. In retrospect, I should have, but it's too late. But now. you're in the lead. So I, yeah. I, I have proof of that. <laughs> I, I, I know. It's it's um Okay. Not for so, long. Those keys are done. Okay, take your cards back. Let's replenish the ingredients. Well, you're not for long. He's in the lead now. Oh, yeah. You're side behind the solstice. Yeah. Uh, we're going to advance the solstice marker. It's only getting advanced one more time once we pass right. that. Uh, <clears throat> this got passed to me. This is the last round. Okay, it's exciting. Uh, so I can climb trees <laughs> and eat my lunch. Uh, yeah. Oh, and this guy advances today. Hmm. Oh, and then do, how much did we replenish? Did oh, we yeah, re- income. So everyone gets three. Okay. 
a beach sure. resource. Yeah. Just making sure I, we did that. No, good good point. Kind of need that resource. For sure. Okay, so I'm going to start. I'll put this guy out, and he's going to go right over there. So I am going to spend two stone and get my last card. Can you have my last card? Here you go. And I'm going to spend an additional stone to climb up that tree, because I remember to use it this time. Yep. So, go in there. And this moves now, right? And it moves. A solstice happens. Okay. So, both you and I get two feathers. I'm going to gain one mistletoe. You're going to gain one mistletoe. Both you and I, both you and Barros get one stone, and I get two stone. Okay. Two stone pizza. Your turn. My turn. Oh, that's exciting. I think what I am going to do is I'm going to play this. This is one feather. Mm -hmm. That one feather character will be him. He's going to go to the two spot. That one feather is going to allow me to move up a spot. I'm going to go take the spot. Okay. And did I get something for going there? No. No, two. Yeah. So two. Wait. No, you don't get something for going there. Oh, I don't. This is, you get two per. Two per. That's at the end. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, well, well. How about it? How about them apples? Remember, at the end of the game, you can also you do one this one time. The trade in ingredients. Mm. Different ingredients will get us points at the end, correct? Mm -hmm. All right. All right. I want to. I could build another shrine, right? Because I can put it here. Mm -hmm. The shrine of a silver monkey? Yeah. The shrine of a silver monkey. Yeah, I yeah. wish. Yeah, it'd be six points. All right. And then it's a discount with Fachin over here. Mm hmm. So we we'll use and if you send this guy to more of a discount, right? Two so more. it'll only be two, one off of here. No, two. So it's three of one, three of another. Actually, it's one. It's 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 uh yeah. So you you choose the two. So it's two of one. It's it it'll be one of one, three of one, and zero of the other. All right, so we'll do three feathers. No, two feathers. Two feathers, one stone. And that's it. And nothing for mistletoe. Right? This guy right? Is that right? correct? I am I doing that? So? Or am I doing it incorrectly? Because it's it's three off, so mistletoe's gone, right? Mistletoe doesn't have to be paid. Don't do off. mistletoe. Got it. Okay. Oh, and then your two discount is on that. So it is three of the, of the raven. Okay. It's three. So one there. Never more. One there, right? right. There. Yep, that's, okay. that's correct. That's if I put this guy up there. Yeah. Okay, and then I get this. Which means you get six points. So you're up at 34. Yep, yep, yep. All right, those are still aside. All right, let me see how we can play these actions. Oh, that's cool. Uh, yeah, I have enough for that. <clears throat> oh, this is this is gonna be tight. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is gonna be fiercely tight. So let me just see how I'm gonna do this. Uh, green, so black tree. I have to go there. Green tree. I'm only one away. It's good. And then, lastly, uh, the brown tree, I'm two away. I want you to let it go. Oh, right. Okay, sorry. 
min maxing here. It's not sorry, I'm not really min maxing, I'm just trying to see. I can go up that track. I have to go up that track. And this one's not gonna Oh, but I can trade. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's so cool. Yeah. Nah. I like that. Oh right, I can do that. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. So I'll do this one. And I'm gonna go right over here. And I'm gonna spend one miss and I'm gonna uh, start trading some stuff in. So of that stuff. I'm gonna do one mistletoe. No one yeah, one to one. And then now I could do that right there. That's gonna be that's not gonna happen. Oh right, it can happen still. Right. Okay, cool. Okay, so I'm doing that, trading one mistletoe for one stone. And now I am going to uh, spend one mistletoe to climb up this and close that off. Okay, that's my turn there. Okay, uh, I am going to play this. This is the one stone. And just because I closed it off, you can still go on there this round. Yeah. It's at the end of the round, it's really locked. Like, we don't really... And which one is that again that you went to? The green. So, you going this way, you could still go here. No, what is it? Points, though? Uh, oh, for every completed potion. Yeah, I have one. Yeah. I'm going to go to the one spot in the... No, this is not the stone area. It's in the... Can't do the fist area, so you know what I'll have to do. I'll have to be him who goes there. You mean the feather person? You may use your bird person, right? So you could avoid. No, I'm doing this. I'm not using a bird person. Oh, is it the bird person? Yeah, that's the right one. The bird person's the one that ignores. Yeah, sorry, the bird person is ignoring. Yeah. Right. The it's the rule. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna ignore the rule. Um, and that allows me to go into the bag. Where mm -hmm. did the bag go? Right here. Then you you can all go because I'm just gonna pull from this back. Okay. Oi 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 oi. All right. I think. I think. I think. I think. These are some pretty big pots they uh brewed over here. Yeah. Seem like they would do a little overkill. It's a little much, right? All right, I'm going to play this feather card. Go to first feather spot, which lets me move by triangle, correct? Mm hmm. So I can move this triangle right here. Yep. Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do this and spend three feathers to climb up on the feather track. I'll go right here and I'll gain two points. Okay. Well, I think I, I put this here for some reason, so I assume I intended to do it. Um, did I? It doesn't seem like that makes sense. Um, uh, hold on a sec here. Can't take any more of those. Oh, but I do need more treasures to do that. Never mind. Okay. That's fine. I think what I'm actually gonna do is take this guy, go here, take me down to the paradise. Take me down two points. Or Whoa. But I'm gonna go up to eight feathers. Okay. I need some feathers. Okay, I'm gonna up. Well then, I'm trying to get this 
seems like the oh, I'm never gonna get up to that last tree spot. I feel like I'm out of tree game. Uh, Should retreat. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can I jump out of the tree? Does that do anything? <laughs> <laughs> if I break something, I'm surrounded by druids. So I'm we sure didn't need to give you such bad treatment. Okay, boy. Stop. Oh boy. You act like I'm committing treason. Ugh. Are they going to talk about extending an olive branch or something? <laughs> no. I didn't think about that one. So okay, congratulations for adding. There you go. You really didn't Stop. leaf anything out of it. Oh, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> That's not about right. <laughs> Alright. So I'm going to spend here the remainder of my mistletoe to go... To the second mistletoe spot. So can I have a shrine card thing and then yeah. flip it over, right? And build this thing? Yeah. You get defend you can get two or four. Well, I'll get four. Because you know, Alright, so you're gonna go up your there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright. So I'm gonna play my ancient one. Ancient bullwinkles going right here. We're going to spend four stone, and I ignore anyone else there because I'm ancient. Uh, so Kinda with my jerk. four stone, I'm going to trigger a card that's here. I'm going to trigger the one that lets me advance on a tree track. So I'm going to advance on here, and then because of this, I'm going to spend one stone and move up to the and next. move up to yeah. the next. All right. Okay. Well, I'm going to now go here. I'm going to... Well, I could. I have to spend two. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is it worth it? I don't know that it is. Oh, crap. I got ingredients, I guess. I kind of want to. You threw off my game now. I threw off my own threw game. off my groove. No, I threw off my own game. I screwed up. Yeah. Um, it, it just is what it is. It's the altitude. Yeah, it's the altitude, yeah. yeah. Um, oh, Check no, the altitude. I, can, I, should, I would have never done the other move had I realized what I did before. Um, We're getting close to the end. Too. Well, Things are ramping up. Wait, no, I'm actually okay. This is a feather spot, so I'm fine. Um, I'm going to take this one. Go here in the second. Hold on to your back. Put it on the wrong shoulder. That's the issue. I, you you well, see, this is how I the bag should go. I understand that, but it fell off before. That's the only reason it was on the wrong It was shoulder. on the wrong shoulder. No, it wasn't on the wrong shoulder originally. That's my point. Uh, we um, have, we have I'm taking record this record one. I believe video. this one is for every one of those complete, I get a victory point. I think whenever you complete one, you get a victory point. Oh, yeah. I thought it was... Oh. I'll double check. Uh, number 29 is 1VP anytime you activate an artifact. Oh, Oh, so when you just activate it. All right, I'll take it. What the hell? That's nice. I'll take it. I'll activate an artifact. And you gain 3 VP yeah. right now. Sure you will. Oh, I need 3 VP just for doing that. Yeah. Look at you, Mr. Points. All right, that's my turn. Quail. 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 I feel like I had a plan and forgot what it was. Oh. Typical. Typical me. Typical. What can I say? You. do, 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 do. do. Candyman King. Let's see here. What might that Who have can? Been? What's his name? Who can? Uh, <laughs> the Candyman King. Alright, no climby climby. That doesn't really do me any good. Oh, I know what it was. Alright. Get a card? Can I go? Oh, wait, I can't go there. No, I can because I can go. So the one spot. No. Y yeah, to treat right. it like to treat it like two. Treat like oh, but not three. Yeah. yeah. Oh Great. yeah, nothing treats it like three. Darn it. So I can't believe it. Son of a biscuit. Son of a biscuit. You can't brew anything either. So I only have one stinking mushroom. Well, you could do that one, but that one's useless actually. I mean, it'll give you a point, because you still brew it. 
Well, I mean, it'll give you one of those. It doesn't, it doesn't give you a point. I'm sorry. It gives you a point if you are there. Yeah, but I can't get up there. Yeah. Ugh. To indicate that these actually went, I'm just going to put them upside down. Just, these oh, yeah. have yet to be scored. Right. Uh, what would I get if I climbed up the yellow tree spot? Two points? No, Two points. Point. Yeah, I guess I'll do that. That's good for you if you head that way. Mm-hmm. Right here. Mm -hmm. Okay. <clears throat> You're at forty now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I am gonna go up on the feather track. Closed up the tree. Yeah. Well, it's not closed up. I mean, it's right? Just... No, you closed up yours yeah. on the tree. All right. I am going to do my this i'm gonna go get to repeat any action my repeat action is gonna be grab anything i want from the bag thank you let me see what do i want well i'll have you know i plan on my whole turn what i plan on my next three turns that's good for you i think did anyone ask no <laughs> they did not all right that's my turn Oh, and I get a victory point for doing that. Ah, oh, jeez. I gotta catch up. Okay. Um, I... I guess I'm passing. So you're passing? Well, I can't play this. You could exchange yeah. resources. So what then, end, though? Yeah, then right. It's my last card. Yeah. So you... Well, what about this? Yeah. You could get a free animal. No place to put them. Oh. oh, we don't have you enough of their... Well, know. you could do that. Do what? I mean, yeah. Because you could do that to exchange for Mistletoe, and then the next turn, you move that over and put that guy there. That was cost three Mistletoe. No, that's what I mean. So if you... This, this free Mistletoe, right? Right. So if you send this guy out... Oh, but... Yeah, you're going to lose a person. Yeah. I think that's it. You take one. Oh, nuts. Too many nuts. Your turn uh, says. I was... Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I am going to collect three uh, ingredients. All right. And then my turn? Yeah. I will pass. And ingredients are good because remember, we're going to score that. So you want different Ooh, ingredients. Yeah, I don't have any more people. Yeah. Oh, I'm crap. done. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I'm out of people as well. Okay, so it's just me now. It's just you playing all your planned turns that you told us. You're about. right, you're right, you're right. <laughs> I will. So let's do this first. I'm going to brew the topmost potion of three, right? Oh, wait, I thought we could have to wait to the end to do that. No, you could do it any time, but in the end, in addition, you get that. Oh, so hypothetically... Okay, no, no actually, I would have waited. Never mind. Because the waiting got me a fifth one, so I would have waited. Got it. And actually, it doesn't really help me anyway, because I think if I do that... Yeah, I mean, I'll do it. I mean, it's it's no difference now or later. So what, are you getting seven points? Oh, wait, it is difference. Yeah, five points. Five points. Because oh, I did three, but because I sent this out person out, it counts as four. So, uh, five points. Okay. That makes sense. Okay, okay. cool. Cool. Okay. Now, uh... Now I'm going to discard two of these to gain a mistletoe. This is where he comes and wins, though. Yeah. I think so. I think so. I hope so. Life. Going out over... Uh, I, I think know. it's going to be fa fairly tight, but the, uh, I but it's squeaking by. No, I, I, I don't think I could do it. Because if I go there... Yeah, because I, I was trying to get an additional one of those cards. Right. But I don't have the room. Because if I had the room... Okay. All right, that's fine. That's fine. So I will instead... Uh, yeah. I will go to this spot. And my bird person ignores that rule. Yep. Um, I'm going to look in the bag and just take one. So I'm just going to take a ingredient. Oh, and I oh. brewed a portion. So give me a, a potion. Token. Token. Thank you. 
You want to take one that you don't have, right? Correct. So I'll just take this one. Okay. And I've already advanced on the green tree. Yep. Okay. That is it. Okay. So, uh, let's do final scoring. Can I well, let's do our choke. Yeah, the keys and stuff. I have five different ones. Well, oh, hang on. We're going to do the keys. So, we can just leave the people on the board. Yeah. Um, I'll go this way around the tree. So, I'm going to gain four victory points. Can you move me to 30? I could do it. Four? Uh, 33. You're at 33. And then you're going to gain uh, two points. So, move yourself up to 40. Okay. Now, for this one, I have four of these. So, that's eight points. Okay. So, move me up to 41. And now, for every five... I get a point. So I'm at 41, so that's 8 points. So oh, Jesus. 49. Yep. Mm -hmm. That's what I said. <laughs> okay. All right. Now, the last... Yeah. I have um, I have five different ones, so I get seven points, I believe. Uh, you do. So you get seven points, bringing you to 47. I have three different ones, so I'm getting three points. I only have two. You have two, so you have three points. <laughs> And I believe that no, I you three. is two. You have three different ones? No, I have only two. Oh, you only have two. Never mind. Sorry, I thought you said you had... Oh, no, I mean... Uh, I read that you got get radius. three. Yeah. Yep, yeah. and that is it. Wow, it was... Okay. Wow. It was tight. You pulled it You pulled it through in the end. You pulled it through in the end. Invested in the tree. <sighs> that tree. Yeah. That tree. <laughs> that was really fun. Yeah. And I lucked out with these art... With these creatures... Yes. Ah, uh, man, that was fun. Okay. I'm glad we played this. And it's a 2022 release. There you go. Yeah. So it's content. So it's, first of all, Shelf of Shame entry. Yep. Done. Second of all, it is a 2022 release, which is good for... Uh, I'm going to switch cameras. Boop. Hi. Second, uh, so it's good as a candidate for... Favorites of 2022. Yeah. yeah. And this is pretty this is a solid game. Yeah. This you, is solid. And you get to play with And I feel like if I play this again, I'm gonna move probably slightly quicker and it's I I think it could be an hour and a half game. Yeah. Quite frankly. I'm gonna try it again. Yeah. Let's go right now. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> that was Would it fun. take us two hours? That's not that bad. Yeah. No, about with two a hours. teach and everything. But that was two hours with a teach. That's yeah. what I'm saying. This is easy. I think we start, I think we jumped in like <clears> the <throat> twenty minute mark. Yeah, so I've this yeah, is, yeah, yeah. This could easily be an hour and a half game as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. yeah. It says sixty to ninety minutes in on um, Board Game Geek. Yeah. No, it's solid. Really yeah. like it. That tree was fun and Yeah, I, I liked playing the tree. I like also that you that Anthony played creatures. You played a lot of the really a lot of Well, I, I played to my board, right? Oh. So yeah. my board was all about potions. I played more to some of the things that just happened to come to my stuff. Yeah. Because it actually, my stuff ended up being built around the feathers. Yeah. Because I knew I got these feathers, I could get them, rebuild them, and it kind of decided other things, so. Yeah. I wish I got this earlier. Yeah, that was huge. And then you had the one that gives you a victory point. If I got that earlier. That's why, like, yeah. we're very close. Like, you yeah. know, like, you, you know. Well, it, to final t score is 52, 47, 40. Yeah. They're all relatively close, you know? And I blocked off any reason for him to go up one way. Had I blocked you, I still think you might have found another way to do it. I would have, I would or, have, been, I would have been down eight points. Right, but he could have worked his way. So I would have lost. Right. Well, then you would have gotten... You, but he might have been able to work his way. You might have been able way. to work maybe, your way. Maybe. We don't know. And that would have been eight points for you. Hmm. Eight, point, would, eight point swing. That would win you. That's what I'm yeah. saying. If he had the eight point swing, he gets ahead of me. That's Man. my point. Like, it could have swung. So you king ways. made effectively i can yeah i kind of <laughs> did i i will say that but no thanks everybody that is oak uh we'll be back next week with call the board on call wednesday board. yeah choo -choo. Board. so be part of the show call us uh call us live and uh we got some let's know if you like this angle it's a new angle yeah different change up a little you like this so. angle it's a lot easier for me to read the comments because <laughs> they're a lot closer now oh, oh, yeah. oh with the tv yes yeah oh, yeah 
Well, thank you, everybody, for being uh, part of the show tonight. Uh, if you're watching this later after the fact, have any questions about what we thought about the game or any moments, feel free to leave in the comments. We're definitely going to talk about it on our Patreon. And we'll be talking about it in the Patreon yeah. podcast. So if you are a member of our Patreon, uh, you'll be hearing a little bit more about this in that podcast that uh, just you get. Um, other than that, I just want to say have a great night and come back next Wednesday, I believe. We're, yep. we're scheduled for 9 p.m. for Call Aboard. Bye, everyone. Have a great night, everybody. Yeah, put the music. Is this the music? Hey, I mean, we need music. There you go. That's fine. Have a good night, guys.